Hey guys, I um, just decided to start a video um, for my regulator rectifier in the um, in the airbox of the GSXR 600 2006 model. Uh, that's it there. Um, basically, what I've done is I've drilled a couple of holes to mount this um, in the bottom of the airbox. Uh, airbox pulled apart, and then drilled a hole for the for the wires to run through. Um, this here is what I actually wanted to show you. When you get your plugs. Um, you might have to get a small screwdriver and just, just push the little pins down. Um, I don't know if you can see that pin right at the top there in the centre. You just push them down you just pull the cables out of the back. Um, and the reason for this is so they can fit through the hole and then just push your plugs back on the end once you've once you've got it out the other side. Um, this is the third time I've had to replace my regulator rectifier and this is the reason why I'm mounting it in the air box so I can get the air rushing over it um, before the filter and hopefully um, not burn out another one. I'll um, follow up with another video shortly. Hey guys, um, so I've had the, the, the terminals off the end of the plugs, uh, the plugs and the terminals have popped out. Anyway, a uh, nice little screwdriver will, uh, will enable you to, um, to pull them out um, quite easily. Basically what I've done is I've pulled them out and shoved them through just a hole which I've made down here. I don't know what size it is, probably around, probably around 9 or 10 mil, whatever, maybe, maybe a bit smaller. Um, yeah, anyway, and the, the terminals are hanging out the end there. Um, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to shove them as far up as I can and just probably seal it on this um, on this piece of conduit, I guess, um, guess here. And then we'll mount this uh, down here in the airbox. Alright, alright guys, um, I've got the regulator rectifier mounted in the, in the airbox. Um, uh, this thing here, actually probably one thing I would like to show you is maybe if, if I did it again I would have drilled the hole. Uh, closer on this this bottom flat edge to the actual the actual bend here. Uh, I didn't actually think about it, but the cables actually kind of slightly tucked back. Um, they don't actually go underneath the regulator, but they just have to go straight down. Just puts a lot of tension on them here. Uh, I'm thinking with them all crushed together as well. It's probably not such a good idea, but I mean time will tell. Um, we'll see what happens, I guess. Um, it is mounted in there now. Uh, if you look in the side, you'll see I've used some pretty dodgy. Um, dodgy wood screws in here at the moment, but it's just to hold it in temporarily. Um, I'd rather use like a kind of a nice 10 mil or something, but um, it's, um, yeah, I don't know, not much I can do now. Um, I'll see how it runs like this and um, should be all good, but I'll get back to you in a second. Um, Alright, this is the job the motorcycle shop did, so they cut off my original original 4 pin plug and, and put just two terminals on. Uh, I don't understand why they did it. Uh, not really happy with the job. The soldering job's obviously not the best. Um, if it focuses, it would be grey. But it's not going to focus on that. There we go, it's focused now. But, um, yeah, anyway, so I'm going to cut these off and put an original plug back on. I got it from uh, this place called Beaver Motorcycles in the UK. Uh, I'll get back to you in a sec. Alright guys, so um, this is what it looks like after, the, um, after I've repaired the, I guess, plugs on the end. Um, we'll let it focus. There you go. Um, so they're all soldered in there now, um, looking original. I've got the original plug that I will put on the end. Uh, that's about it. All right, guys, um, I put the plugs back together. Um, this um, this plug here, if it'll focus, there you go. So I put that back together. Uh, the conduit's back on, um, pretty much mounted. I'm just going to throw the bottom half of the airbox in. Actually, I'm not because I'm going to put the filter back in first because I have to do these screws up from. Oh no. No, oh, I can. No, I can put it in now. I'll do that, and um, I'll um, keep you updated. All right. Um, forgot to take uh, videos of the, the box back in. Uh, it's back in now, anyway. Um, and um, it's all wired up. Um, I'm just putting my um, my last pieces on, just garnishes and, and the seat. And uh, yeah, anyway, I've already taken it for a ride, um, and it seems to charge and work fine. I mean, uh, the reason I did this is because it was coming up to summer, and um, I uh, didn't want to risk burning out another um, uh, another regulator in the middle of peak hour traffic. So um, yeah, anyway, so anyway, I've replaced it. I'll let you know how it goes. Um, ask me your questions in six months or so, and we'll see how long it lasts sitting in the airbox.